I think this society may have it wrong. It's too many women that's single and waiting until the last minute to get a, a husband or a boyfriend, a man, or even have kids. Or they're waiting to the last minute to have kids by the right man. You know, they thinking they have a lot of time, but 90 something percent of the men, women don't have a lot of time. Their beauty don't last that long, which tells me God has made them where they need to find a man while they're young. If they find a man when they're older, their beauty gonna be down and their fertility gonna be down. So that don't make sense for them to try to get a man at the last minute of their heightened attraction or and their fertility. So, you know what I mean? So it don't make sense. You know, God don't want you to rush, wait to the last five, last two years of fertility and say, I want a good man. Okay, I want a good man now. Okay, I want to have kids now. I know finances and all that stuff play in the fact, but if you're in America, you, your kids ain't gonna starve, yo. Your kids not gonna starve, you know. So it's just, it amazes me how women say, I got all the time in the world, I'm young. You're young to do what? Give your body to a whole bunch of dudes that's nasty, that don't want you, that's not taking you seriously? Is that what you doing? Is that what it's all about? You know what I'm saying? Is, is, is that what being young is all about? No, nah, I don't think so. Being young shouldn't be all about that. It's not all about, you know, giving your body, seeing how many guys you can be with. It's not a marathon. It shouldn't be a hand bone marathon or how many guys you can let smash your cheeks before you, before you lose your looks and want to settle down. You know what I'm saying? It's ridiculous. But I'm Alan Regan. Hit that like button, subscribe button, notification bell button. Follow me on Instagram at Alan Regan and Show. The fact that women beauty don't last that long. I mean, it's, it, it's a very, very short window. And that's why they're putting so much energy into trying to make it last. And it's such a powerful market, um, money-making market, in trying to make it last with all this, you know, the enhancements and stuff. But it's still not natural and it don't look natural. It can, sometimes it look good, it can get you for a quick second, but when you start looking at it carefully, you can just see all of the flaws and look like a bumblebee butt and all that. It's just not really, you know, it's not natural. Anything not natural is not gonna be, it's not gonna be normal, you know? But, so, I mean, in reality, it's, I don't even think it's just the body. I just think that the whole emotions and Everything is better when, when they're younger. You know, back at, our grandmothers and them got married at 18 and all that type of stuff. And a lot of times our grandfathers was older, you know what I'm saying? But now, you know, they record, they're telling women to get ran through by a hundred guys and then say at the last minute, I got my money together or whatever you think you got together. I had all the experience I want. That's not experience. Who wants an experienced woman? With other men oh you've been with so many guys i know you you did a lot you got a lot of practice for me no no that's not good that's like saying hey underwear you got a lot of practice for me i want i can't wait to put you i can't wait to put you on there you know you don't want to experience underwear why would you want to experience woman where well, you're gonna put what you hold in your underwear you know it just it really don't make too much sense, you know, but it's this society, I think we got it. We got it all wrong, man. We need to be promoting family and early families. Not, they make, <laughs> it's all a money grab. It's all a money gain. It's all a money grab. You just make too much money off you when you're single, you know, and then when you rush to get in a relationship, it's not gonna work most of the time. That's why the divorce rate, and they make money off that. They're making money off all your mistakes. You're talking about a, a you're talking about a, a, a game of Vegas. That's a Vegas. That's just we. They got it all trapped up in so many, so many pit falls for you. Oh, you waited too long. You fell over that trap. Uh oh. Now you're trying to rush to hit because you know your biological clock. 
Now you feel that trap. Now you gotta you feel that trap. You feel that trap. You feel that trap. All these different traps you you fall. You know, it's just ridiculous, man. But I'm Alan Reed. Now hit that like button, subscribe button, notification bell button, and uh, follow me on Instagram for consultation. My Instagram is Alan Ray in that show. You also can send those Pookie Ray song challenge videos there along with your, your cash app so my team can tip you off. No ditty. I'll holler at y'all later, man. Stay prayed up. Yesterday gone forever tomorrow, I promise. Give Jesus your life right now.